Good morning, Lower Pre. How are you? Today is Friday. This is Miss Yoon. Welcome to Miss Yoon's story time. Today, we are going to read a book called One Lonely Seahorse. That's gonna be what we are reading today. But first, I would like to say hello to everybody. Hello, Ayana. Hello, Luca. Hello, Evan. Hello, Louise. Hello, Frankie. Hello, Charlotte. And hello, Terry. Good to see you again. Well, today's the Friday before the weekend. I hope you enjoy your Friday and have a good weekend. But we are going to sing a morning song first. One, two, three. Good morning, good morning, good morning to you. Good morning, good morning, oh, how do you do? Good morning to you, good morning to you. Oh, we're in our places with sunshiny faces. Oh, this is the way to start our new day days of the week 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 there's sunday and there's monday there's tuesday and there's wednesday there's thursday and there's friday and then a saturday days of the week 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 Yesterday was Thursday, Thursday, Thursday. Yesterday was Thursday all day long. Today is Friday, Friday, Friday. Today is Friday all day long. Tomorrow will be Saturday, Saturday, Saturday. Tomorrow will be Saturday all day long. What? Oh, what will the weather be? What? Oh, what will the weather be? What? Oh, what will the weather be? What will the weather be? Will it be sunny? Will it be rainy? Will it be cloudy? Will it be snowy? Will it be windy? Will it be snow stormy? What will the weather be? I'm looking outside. It's very cloudy. And I think the temperature gonna be a little bit low. So yesterday was hot, but today it's gonna be a little bit cooler. So, enjoy your day outside while you can, okay? Let's just start reading a book. I like this book because it uses a lot of uh, vegetables to you, um, create the scene. The book, was, book is called One Lonely Seahorse. Let's read. Oh, and it's written by... Saxton Freeman and just Alphers. Very hard to read. Pronounce their names, huh? All right, let's go. Ready? One beneath the ocean. Deep and wide, one lonely drifting seahorse cried, In all the cold and salty sea, I'm all alone, there's only me. Look at this. There's a seahorse right here. But I think it's made out of a sweet potato. Do you think so? name was B and B was blue and as she cried her sadness grew 
So the seahorse is under the sea and he's swimming along, being sad that he's alone. And there's some plant under the sea. Do you see that? I think that plant is called a it's made out of a hand of the wood mushroom. Yes, they use the hand of the wood mushroom to depict the plant under the sea. We'll two will be your friends. You're not alone. Call the two small crabs by a big round stone. So the seahorse found a friend and there's a two crabs that are by the rock. And isn't that interesting? The seahorse is made of, um, let me see, actually. Did I tell you the right name for seahorse? No, actually Miss Yoon was wrong. The seahorse was made out of a Chioja beach. It's the beach. And now we are gonna see shiitake mushroom tamarind. That's what the crabs are made out of. You see that? Yes, it's a type of the mushroom they made uh, crab crabs out of. And what's the big stone? What did they make a big stone out of? I think it was the potato. They used the potato to show it, right? And there's a little round, this um, orange thing. I wonder what the orange thing is. Oh, it's also type of the mushroom. It's called oyster mushroom. So they use a lot of mushroom to build the scene. This is the mushroom and this is the potato. And this is also the mushroom. That is fun, right? What's next? Let's find out. Three puffer fish came from behind. We'll join you too if you don't mind. There's three puffer fish joining the seahorse. I wonder what these three puffer fish is made out of. I think it's horned melon. It's made out of a horned melon. So it's a type of a melon they created the scene with. The puffer fish. Ooh, fun, right? Four lobsters down below called. Hey, you're our pal too. Come on, let's play. Now there's more animals, sea animals here. There's four lobsters and these four lobsters are made out of a what i think it's the ginger they made out of let's find out if i was right let me see i think so yes it was the ginger and then let's find out and there's so many other things behind this too a lot of different kind of potatoes and green beans all in this scene what a creative scene that they could they made huh oh there's more five turtles circle the beer to say can we help out in any way? Now there's what? Five turtles on the scene saying, I'm your friend too. What do you think this turtle is made out of? A tropical fruit. 
a pineapple, right? I love it. They made a pineapple to make a turtle. Fun, fun. Ooh, I like this one. Six playful dolphins then arrived. Hey, B, they called. Let's leap and dive. Ooh, I see dolphins. And what do you think the dolphins are made out of? You all know it. What is it? Banana, right? Banana. And I like how they use the green pea pod to make a little scene out of Maybe they were trying to create the seaweed. What about this? Let's see. Seven eels said, what a shock. You are so unhappy. We should talk. There's seven eels are also saying that I can be your friends. We can be your friends. And what do you think these eels are made out of? Let me find out. It's a cranberry bean. They made it with a cranberry bean. What creative that is, right? I like how they made this scene out of all different kinds of vegetables. Let's find what they did on the next page, okay? <gasps> Ooh, I like this one. Eight, an octopus said, We are here too. All eight of us have hugs for you. Ooh, I like this a lot too. So eight octopus came to to be and said, we can be your friends too. And what are these octopus made out of? Banana game, right? Dolphins made out of banana and now octopus are made out of banana, huh? I love this. Nine mackerel then came swimming by. You feel lonely? Tell us why. There's a nine mackerels are coming here, coming to the seahorse saying, talk to me, please. Let's find out what they made this eel, this mackerel out of. I think they are called Asian eggplant. They made this e um, mackerel with Asian Eggplant. Yes. I love that how creative they are. What's coming next? Let's find out. A school of angelfish appeared. Ten little voices laughed and cheered. Also, the bee wasn't lonely because there was ten Angelfish came and then played with him. And I wonder what these 10 angelfish is made out of. I think you guys know. It's the bell peppers. Green, yellow, red, orange. All different colors of green peppers they use. I love that. I love that. I love that. And let's find out. Also, oh, on this scene, I see ginger and some other mushrooms. Let's see, what was it? I see kale and I see a uh, ginger and a uh, enoki mushroom. What fun. You see melon right here? Actually, this one is a melon and there's a ginger. And there's a gnocchi mushroom and green pep. It's all the bell peppers, yellow, green, and red, and orange. So many different kinds of vegetables, huh? You are my friends, said B. That's true. 
and I can always count on you. Look at all of the animals that came and said hi to them. There's dolphin, octopus, there's a blowfish, and there's turtles, and eel, and then there's a crab, and what else? I see the angelfish, right? I love this. And the end. So, in the end, the seahorse is not lonely anymore because she has all these friends. And you want to know what all the sea made out of? Look at all the mush, all the vegetable that we. This book have used to depict the sea, oceans, right? Banana, beet, different kinds of mushrooms, bell peppers, and banana, and Asian eggplant. So many kinds. I love this. They even used the lettuce, white squash, and potato, cauliflower, ginger, Kale, cantaloupe, celery root, oyster mushroom. There's so many different kind of oyster mushroom too. I loved it. It's very creative and very imaginative, right? I hope you enjoyed this book and I hope you have a great, great weekend. I will see you on Monday. Bye-bye.